morning friend uh, today uh, we are going to talking about the sleep tree fall hazard as a safety professionals you should know the first hazards sleep tree falls this is a very good things and very be small thing but risk will be very high if in case of some persons fall due to some uh, slippery e and some obstruction so we are talking about the slip trip falls uh, fall hazards in construction industry e industry and uh, and uh, hazards and controls measures so if you are working in construction se sectors then there are lot more and mo more chance of slip trip fall fall so slip trip is, is generally created uh, created by three four types of uh, three e four uh, type of hazards arts and cause of uh, cow, uh, and common cause of slip trip at construction project first uneven surface if you have observed that your construction road and uh, your uh, floor if you are going to construction there are many chances of an many chance of an event surface due to not maintenance by the organization if you are uh, seeing uh, if you, you can see the, uh, the construction road an event so that times if you are going to moving on the road then maybe maybe chance of fall due to slip uh, due, due to slip and maybe trip then after that fall so this is a basic requirement basic uh, basic it has a uh, uh, basic cause of slip trip on uh, at a construction project second thing unsuitable surface unsuitable surface means if you have a a, a mountain area so there are unsuitable surface so there are very difficult to who manage them and label them so this is a very if very very a big chance of slip trip in your industry and sometimes wastage of concrete heap of concrete in, in workplace and construction workplace so there are many chance of slip and trip and fall of workers on course of construction work second things tra trailing cables trailing cables are some you know that uh, uh, electrical cables and trailing so there are many chance of well, many chance and cause of slip trip fall in construction sector because of cable trailing some people's uh, uh, armor cables going on the, uh, uh, going on on the floors laying on lay on floor so there are more chance of slip trip fall so this is a root cause this is a main cause of slip trip fall at your workplace second thing obstructions in workplace you know that if you are are build uh, build and uh, building and construction sector there are many deficient uh, many problems related the proper material stacking some people come uh, come and stack the uh, materials on walkway area because of as a safety professionals so you have to maintain the I uh, access each and uh, at uh, each and every times because of their responsibility and they are a, a responsibility to provide proper uh, proper safety e provision and proper safe access but some people should not aware aware about the uh, safety and go and uh, and accumulated the uh, materials and pick that materials on the access way so there are many chances and cause of obstructions in walkway and system and access area suppose that if you are uh, uh, working in a 20 e floor civil building so there are two access minimum two access must be free from obstruction and wet lighting arrangements because of if you have not lighting proper then maybe e e more chance of of slip trip fall due to pro, in, pro, due to poor illuminations illuminations because of if you have not illuminate uh, illuminations then you are moving on the uh, access and uh, on the road 
there may be chance of slip drift cause so this is a basic cause of um, basic uh, basic cause of slip drift fall the second thing next is there mentioned footwear footwear is very important and uh, importance for a four and importance and cause of uh, if you are using a formal and and formal uh, safety uh, shoes then maybe we more chance of slip and trip fall so we, have, we must be use of safety shoe who which are very uh, clear and proper sole of uh, sole of safety shoe and uh, and check the and confirm the is standards as per requirement Requirement. So this is a a, a basic. These these are all are basic. We cause of uh, cause of slip trip fall in construction sector. Next is behavior. Behavior is most effective because of you know that everything is good, but but some people's behavior is very bad because of they are using mobile phones while walking and talking on road and walking and talking on staircase because you know the staircase is always uneven surface because that call a staircase because of uh, this is a very important for you if you are going to going to climb and go, going to go ascending and descending on ladder uh, on uh, staircase and climb um, up and down by the staircase then you must be be careful so don't walking and talking proper conscious and proper watch the step because of some people's walking and talking some people's is watching the some some place somewhere and uh, maybe slip and trip if on staircase many cases come uh, came um, came into to the staircase because of there are using mobile phones and sleep uh, and fall on the uh, fall uh, on the staircase. So these all are basic requirement and basic root cause. We can say the root cause of major root cause of slip trip fall in construction sector. The uh, slip and trip, not fall. Slip and trip. So this is a basic uh, root cause of slip trip in construction sector. So how to minimize? How to mitigate them? These. These, these all are very important for you. Sleep resistance surface and footwear. How to maintain the sleep resistance surface? So oh, that also related the housekeeping. So housekeeping is very important. So you know that as pipe, uh, pipe as methodology. This is very important for avoid the sleep trip falls in your fall uh, sleep trip in your construction project. Because of S5 clears, uh, um, clear identify the all root cause. As five uh, S, five S means first is set in order, uh, set in uh, sorting, set in order, sustenance, uh, uh, sorting, set in order, and uh, uh, standardize sustenance, uh, sustenance and uh, standardize. So there are basic five. I elements in, in their maintain so how to maintain sleep resistance surface in your workplace so this is not only for construction sector this is always included the operational building because if if you are not maintaining the surface focus then maybe sleep and trip one accident share with you who I he, he, I heard I heard at the work accident by some of our uh, senior staff. So this is uh, not uh, practically I um, I examined it, but I heard one accident so very good manners. One un girls one girls uh, um, working in a in a operations IT sectors IT sectors when when the, when she is going to who bathrooms that time sleep his uh, yes, her leg her leg and fall down and good fractures his uh, right right left leg only for uh, only for behavior attitude and uh, behavior attitude we can say there are root cause identified so, so first is there sleep there are safety signages are there 
was there due to who some people so some uh, scavengers uh, are cleaning the uh, toilets and bathroom but their area is wetted wet area so girls are not watching the uh, watching the proper surface and slip and slip and fall on the ground so this accident happened in a, a good uh, multinationals company after that investigations the root cause find out of insufficient and uh, insufficient and um, unsuitable you can see unsuitable footwear and unsuitable uh, tiles and after that behavior of um, girls because three root cause major root cause because of tiles are uh, installed are installed anti is not anti skip because of tiles is very slippery after that investigation so root cause find out and second thing you are see which are uh, using the her are using very e sole heel hip heels so heel heel sandals so these are the root cause of of uh, slip tip and after that there are communications are there there are wet um, there was wet surface then how you can go how you how hard to go to bathroom so these root cause are there after that investigations all those thing his leg leg also to style style of uh, of uh, path uh, styles of walking so these all are different so there, there are three root cause find out first is styles and styles quality and second is uh, footwear and third is behavior so this is a very important score for aware them all those people working in your construction sector and other operations building and and slip resistant surface how to observe the slip resistant surface slip resistant surface so maintenance is very important if you have any tiles no but no need to oh, no need to to change if you have already provided the tile system but now what now right now everybody he feels the tile and he skip and he skip it tiles so you should must be always think if you are going to install if already installed the tiles then you must be maintain the proper if you are going to cleaning then must be safety sanitation the area should be barricaded they are working progress so sorry for innovation so that may be nobody he came into the area and maybe avoid the incident after that Sleep resistance footwear. How to identify a uh, sleep resistance footwear? You know that if you are working in construction sector, there are fix of safety shoes. Safety shoes is very man mandatory. If you are going to operation, work in operational building, there are also formal safety shoes, good conditions, and are maintained. And some uh, organization standardize the standardize the uh, quality of shoes which can use in your workplace in our. Uh, workplace so oh safety so if you are working in safety professional uh, safety uh, professional and you know, construction sector then you must be use of safety so which good quality and good foot uh, and the skip sleeper so though we can use of current safety so there are many types of uh, uh, or companies they are so maintaining proper safety shoes. So after that maintenance, how to maintenance on regular basis proper housekeeping, free from obstructions, daily monitoring by the safety of staffs and uh, monitoring the behaviors and safety safety signages are there. So uh, they are always always choose the good things and conduct activity and highlighted the area. Some people are are uh, unprotected bar are there so how to minimize the proper safety training if you are not necessary to do any unwanted head materials then keep uh, keep proper storage and safety sizes and tightly neat and clean side must be maintained because of if you are maintaining the good uh, neat and clean then first reflect your work uh, reflect your work styles and reflect your organizations and behaviors because of they are using a good quality and a proper housekeeping and very nice buildings are are showing 
so we should must be consider about the house king and how to maintain this because of you know that if any visitor has to uh, will be will have to come to site then we first maintain the uh, free access and proper safety sign area and housekeeping because of these these all are very important in construction so that we are giving and we are doing the same so oh go oh, this is a basic requirement how to maintain so guys please be maintained if, if any of success in your workplace then immediate cleaning and proper sanitary step and be tight and all workers must be aware about this and more and more or safety training conduct among the workers so we can avoid